All right, guys, so we are back in the park today. We are going to be hunting Vulpix. Uh, there is a Growlithe on my nearby list, uh, which is nice. Uh, and obviously, I want to catch that because I want myself an Arcanine. But we're here hunting. Oh, my gosh. Dude, I was struggling with this last night. And, of course, you jumped there. I was struggling with my curves. But there we go. Uh, obviously, we're hunting for Vulpix because that's what I'm closest to. We also got eggs to hatch today in this episode. We'll be out and about trying to hatch up some eggs. Uh, hopefully, maybe I can pull a Vulpix or a Growlithe out of one of those. Uh, but then it comes to the point where I have to decide... Come on, Paris. I have to decide... Uh, I swear. Come on. Ah, oh, dang it. I shouldn't have let it go. Sometimes I get lucky with that, and I'll just let it go, and it'll, it'll go back to where you can catch it, where it's not attacking. But Paris? Actually, pretty strong Paris. Uh... I need to get Growlithe out of the egg more than I need Vulpix because what do I have? I think I have 33 Vulpix candies. I only have like 15 Growlithe candies because the only Growlithe I have is the one I hatched from the egg. Dude, this Paris is... Okay, I was going to say, that Paris is some next level. Okay, so let me... We'll drive here for a little bit. I won't be doing like the full circles like we have because I'm going to be here for a while. So we're going to find what Pokemon we can... Uh, since I'm going to be walking around and driving around, a mixture of the two, uh, probably won't have like a little video to show you guys where I am, uh, just because I'll be all over the place in today's episode. See, there's the Growlithe on the map. I guess I could call it select the Growlithe. Oh no, you can't even select them anymore because we don't have the footprints anymore because Niantic decided to remove them over fix them. All right, so let's find one more Pokemon here for this little part here, and then I'll just I'll just cut back in when we find anything of significance. I'm not going to keep showing pointless Pokemon like Pidgeys and Raditas. Okay, here we go. This is actually actually not bad. I actually need Nidoran males and females, so I will take this. Hopefully this goes a little bit better than the Paris went. Let me move up here a little bit so I'm not in the middle of the road so I can get off into the gravel. Of course, can't catch the need right. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and use a raspberry. Ah, oh, dang it! I was hoping for a nice there or a great. I think it was a little too big for a great, but come on, swivel. There we go. Okay, so need and female. I'll take that over catching the Paris because I don't really need Parasex. I do need Needle King and Needle Queen, and we are sitting at sixty-one need and female candies. Uh, so let's see what else hopefully we can find this uh, Growlithe that's actually getting a little bit closer and hopefully we can find some Vulpix as well as hatch all of our eggs here. Uh, I'll show you hatching all the eggs. We don't have any 10k so I should be able to hatch all of these today and then I'm going to go try to find some more eggs tonight probably. Tonight or tomorrow I'll go get some more eggs and we'll get to hatching those. All right, so this isn't the most exciting thing, but we did find this Radita here, and there's also a Krabby, so once we catch this Radita up, we'll get the Krabby. Uh, there's some people walking by my car. Okay, nice, Radita. Radita didn't put up a fight. Great. And so now we've got ourselves a Krabby here. Oops, I almost just tried, tried to throw that. Oh my gosh, it actually hit. I thought I was going to miss the Krabby. That would have been... That would have been awful. All right, Krabby. And I screwed up the Pokeball. Come on, Krabby. Okay, I, I'm second. I need to, I need to get back to, uh, I need to practice my throws because I'm just sucking it up. Okay, that was actually a pretty decent one. Okay, Krabby. What? Are, really, dude? Stop attacking. Just do your attack now. Yeah, there you go. How is that not count? Can I just catch this Krabby, please? Wasted so many Pokeballs on the stupid Krabby. Alright, to 175, Krabby. All right, so we are kind of moving a little bit closer. We're not to the Growlithe yet. I'm assuming it's over there, but 
we will see. All right, guys, so we've got our two 5KM eggs popping off here. Hopefully we get something at least decent. I'm not asking for anything crazy, just something decent. And Meowth, I'll take it, I'll take it. Powerful Meowth would be nice. 413, not the greatest, but we will take it. And here we go with another 5KM egg popping off. What are we going to get? Oh, Ponyta, nice. Nice, my first Ponyta. Amazing. I don't have a lucky egg on, but... It is a new Pokemon. I do want Rapidash. Ponyta will be replaced. Oh, oh, an 849 Ponyta. Nice, 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 nice. That will be replacing uh, Lapras on the screen. Will probably be Ponytas because we're looking for those now to get Rapidash because I do like Rapidash. Uh, but let's see. I think we're getting close to another 5KM. Yep, we are extremely close to this 5KM egg. That won't open, so we should be popping that open here in just a second. All right, guys, so we have another 5km egg popping off here, so let's go ahead and check out what it is. Okay, a tentacle, I will take that. I think we're getting close to a tentacruel, so I will take that. Yeah, we are five candies off a tentacruel evolution. Uh, I do have a tentacruel already, like I've said, I think I showed you guys previously that I caught in uh over at the Chocolate Cafe, or on my way to the Chocolate Cafe, I think. Dude, I can't hit these curl curveballs anymore. <laughs> it's like I lost all my skill. And I can't catch a Pokemon anymore. Come on. I'm hoping for one 5k M egg to turn into a Vulpix or a Growlithe. Oh my gosh, this Zubat is next level. I'm getting my touch back, I think, with the curve, but... I haven't gotten a Growlithe or a Vulpix in an egg for quite some time, but there are so many 5KM Pokemon that I don't know. You can't even really expect anything out of them. You just gotta hope and pray that you get something you want. But my lucky or my incense is about to run out, so we'll pop another one of those. Continue going. Growlithe disappeared off my nearby, so who knows where he went. No sign of any Vulpix yet, but that doesn't mean they're not out here. All right, guys, so we got a nice little pop-up here. We've got a Clefairy. Haven't found one of these in a while. Did I hatch? I think I hatched my only Clef... Come on, Clefairy. I hatched my only Clef... Oh, my gosh, dude, I suck. I can't do the curves anymore. I might need to just toss them like... Like a scrub, because I can't throw them. And don't run away, don't run away, don't run away. Okay, we're going to hit you with a raspberry. I've got plenty of raspberries. Let's, let's go ahead and toss one because this is a Pokemon I, I do need to catch. I do need to catch the ones that I rarely see. Growlithe has reappeared on the map. Still don't know exactly where he is, but he has reappeared on the map, which is good. All right, then we got a Caterpie here. I thought I'd catch this because why... Why the heck not? It's actually a decently strong Caterpie. Did hit the throw there. I, I like it more with the curves. If they're in like the intermediate distance away from you. Not like crazy far. But not close. I don't like them close. It's hard to get a curve off when they're like right in front of you. Caterpie. And I missed. Caterpie. Here we go. One, two, three, boom. Caterpie is mine. Do I have enough to? Yeah, I can evolve some Caterpie, so that's good. All right, but there's Growlithe back on the map. We'll keep moving around, see what we can find, see if we can find uh, find this Growlithe. I'm not sure where it is, but no signs of old picks yet. Kind of disappointing, but hopefully I'll be able to find some here real soon. All right, so this might not be as exciting as a find as, I don't know, as a lot of things, but did find a pretty strong EV here, uh, and I'm always looking to catch EVs be mostly because I still need to get poor, I need to get a good Jolteon, at least like a 1300 Jolteon, because we're out here with one Jolteon that's like 800. I need to, we need to get a better Jolteon, and we may just do that right here if I have enough candies, which I do. Let's go ahead and see about a Jolteon here. Pop a Lucky Egg. 
I don't know why I popped a lucky egg for one evolution. Not really necessary, but... All right, so we've got a 653 EV. I want to save that for something else. I don't really want it to be a Jolteon right now. So let's try the Sparky again. Maybe they patched this thing and it just doesn't work at all anymore because it hasn't worked for me in a while. Okay, none of them are nicknamed. The ones that it doesn't want you to have them nicknamed. So let's see here. Will it give me a Jolteon? It's what I need. I need a Jolteon. Give me a Jolteon. I have enough Flareon and Vaporeons. And... Yo, it's another Flareon, man. I don't know what I'm doing wrong. I can't get... I can't get a Jolteon. 1492 Flareon, so... We've got Flareon... We got Flareons on deck. Strong Flareons here. Like, look at this. 1626, 1522, 1492. kind of want to power this up one so it's over... So it's another 1500 Pokemon, but... I don't really need to do that, but once again, failed at the stupid nickname thing. I don't know if they've patched that or if I'm doing something wrong. I don't think I'm doing anything wrong, but maybe I am. We are getting close to these eggs, 4.4, getting decently close. Hopefully we can hatch something good. Uh, Growl is back on the map. Still looking for him. He's like, it says he's the nearest Pokemon like back here, like where I'm tapping there, but I can't find him back there, so... We'll keep looking around. Hopefully we can find this Growlithe, add a second Growlithe to the collection. Alright guys, so we found yet another Clefairy here. So that's a nice little find here. And it's weak, so it should be... Let me just shut my mouth before I screw this up. Okay, there we go. Okay. Should be an easy catch. Probably shouldn't have said that out loud because it'll probably break out and run away. I'll do it, Clefairy. Thank you. I guess we'll catch the Pidgey here as well. So no Vulpix today, I guess. Uh, one Growlithe that I can Okay, Growlithe is gone now. One Growlithe I can't find. I got out of my car and I ran around and I couldn't find it. I just, oh my gosh, Pidgey. I just couldn't find it. And so we are, we are, you know, looking for this Growlithe here. And... Still, you know, trying to find Vulpix, but I'm not too, um, I'm not too optimistic about finding Vulpix, because I haven't even, oh my gosh, it's another Clefairy. I have to keep driving, because there's like, oh my gosh, this Clefairy he is OP. I have to drive a little bit here, because there's like a service vehicle behind me, and he's being a little douche McGruber, and went past me, so I have to actually go, because he's park, park ranger, or whatever. So let me, let me go here. Okay, yeah, you turn down that road, and I'll continue straight. Okay, so that's the one thing. It is like, I don't know if it's service, not service day, but it's like a, a park upkeep day, I guess is what I'll call it. Uh, that's what it looks like it is. I'm going to have one shot at this, because I think it's going to run away. So we got one Ultra Ball shot at this. That's why I'm using an Ultra Ball, because I think I only have one shot at this. All right, let's catch this Clefairy. Oh, got a nice, got a nice with the curve. That's about as much as I can ask for today. Two, three, got it. There we go. I'll take it. It has a nice use of an Ultra Ball, I think, but it's Clefairies out here. We're up to 17 Clefairy candies. Oh my gosh, there's another Clefairy right here. Oh, this place is crazy. We got Clefairies just, oh my gosh, this is another good Clefairy. Let's pop a raspberry. I don't think it'll run, so I'm going to try Pokeball here first. Might be on a Clefairy hunt now. And, oh my gosh, I caught it, too. These Clefairies aren't that bad to catch. Two strong Clefairies there. Up to 20 candies, and we got a Nottish here. Okay, I can get 10 Fairy-type Pokemon, okay? So that's between Jigglypuff and Clefairies, I think. I think that's the only fair. Oh my gosh. No, oh, Oddish! Struggle with these Pokemon that keep attacking. They keep spamming their attack. Oddish! Just get in the Pokeball and stay. This was kind of nice. There was a nice little hole here. We had Clefairies and we had Pidgeys. We have an Oddish. I'm happy. That was a strong Oddish, right? I needed a better... Yeah, 478. I needed a better Oddish. 
So we've got Clefairies on deck now. Where are those ends? There we go. We've got five Clefairies in the inventory. We can actually junk out these guys because we won't need those. Making our way towards a Clefable, getting near halfway there. All it takes, you know, is an edge egg hatch or two, and you you get really close to some of these. Like, I'm pretty far away from a Wigglytuff, but all it takes is me hatching a Jigglypuff, and I would get so much closer. That's kind of where you are. You hatch an egg, it really boosts you towards the evolution. But if you can't, you know, it's a little bit more of a grind. Uh, but let's see if we can get out here and we can find some more Clefairies, because that would be... That'd be nice. I'd take some more Clefairies, get us towards uh, the Clefables. All right, guys, so here we go. Another 5km egg popping off. What are we going to get? I'm pretty much okay with anything out of these 5km eggs. Obviously, you guys all know what I want out of them, but I'm okay with pretty much anything. A Magnemite, we're up to 37 candies, getting close to a Magneton, so I'm good with that. Uh, caught 10 Electric-type Pokemon. And I think we're getting close to our final three eggs here. Yep, 4.9, 4.4, and 4.4. Hopefully, maybe I can pull a Volpix or a Growlithe out of those, maybe just one. But who knows? I'm taking mostly anything because... Um, I need a lot of the evolution still for stuff in the 5k I'm egg, so I can live with anything out of them. Alright guys, so it is popping Clefairies out here. We've got a 546 sitting in front of me. I think I need to at least Great Ball this bad boy. 546, quite the powerful uh, Clefairy, I think. Actually, I have no idea what's a strong Clefairy or not, but... I definitely need it. There we go. Nice, easy catch. Nice and smooth. Got ourselves a 546 Clefairy. Halfway to a Clefable, which is going to be great. Uh, let's see if we can maybe find some more Clefairies. I guess I moved on from Clefairies to Vol from Vulpix to Clefairies, I guess, at this park. All right, guys. We've got another egg ready to pop off here. So let's see. What are we going to get out of this bad boy? Obviously hoping for Vulpix or Growlithe, but taking anything. All right, neat, neater and female. I'll take it. I'll take it. Probably lower on the totem pole than it should be for me, but I will take that all day. I'll probably pop another Lucky Egg here when we, so I have it. So I, when I pop those two off, I'll get 2,000 experience for it. But hopefully, hopefully those last two yield something that I'm really looking for. That's the, that's the dream, but we'll have to wait and see. Alrighty guys, well, final two eggs going to pop off right here. Let's see what we get. Got a lucky egg all set up. Alright, another Nidoran female. I guess the games want me to get my Nido Queen. 94. And final egg here. You know what? While you're at a game, just give me another Nido Queen female. I'll take it. Okay, I'll take a Poliwag. Making our way up to a Poliwrath currently. Up to 61 candies now. So I'm okay with that as well. Not the ideal Pokemon that I wanted out of there. But anything really out of the 5km eggs, I'll take. Like I said, because I need most of those Pokemon anyway to evolve stuff up. So I'm fine with that. We are getting extremely close to level 24. I could get to level 24 if I wanted to. But obviously, like I said, once a week we're saving Pokemon to evolve in that video. Uh... So we've got Caterpies and Weedles and Pidgeys and some other stuff saved up, including Victory Bell. And I believe by then I should have enough for Gengar. So that's going to be hype. I'm super pumped for that. Uh, I love me some Gengar, so I'm really excited for when that, that happens. I want to make sure I have the most optimal Gengar. Uh, so I may delay that yet another week just to make sure I'm not completing the Pokédex this week. So... I can be a little bit more optimal. That's what I've decided. Let me be a little bit more optimal with some of my Pokemon. Take it a little bit slow. Play it a little bit smarter. Get the most optimal Pokemon. If it takes me an extra couple days, I think it's worth it in the long run. Uh, so who knows? Gengar may skip a week, and we may wait until next week, see if we can get an even more optimal Gengar. All right, guys, so that's going to do it for today's episode. I guess my Vulpix nest turned into a Clefairy nest. Uh, I can live with it. 
I can live with it. A little disappointed that no more, uh, no more Vulpix nests because I still need Vulpix to get myself my Ninetales, but we'll have to go search around and see if we can find another one. Still on that grind, but hey, we fought a lot of Clefairies today. If only we would have had a day like this that was completely lit with the nest Pokemon, it seemed like. Uh, that would have been really nice, and uh, we would have had a Ninetales by now, but we're chilling with like 33, I think it's 33 Vulpix candies. Uh, now we're sitting with like uh, 27 um clefairy candy so i hope you guys enjoyed though this episode uh, drop a like if you did subscribe if you haven't uh and i will catch you guys in tomorrow's video which is going to be something different it's going to be a gym video we're going to go around and take a bunch of gyms uh for team mystic and hit up some pokestops so i hope you guys will check that out but i'll catch you guys then peace out